and welcome to today's video in which we'll be looking at this bush cooker unit now unfortunately it developed a fault the previous evening where the oven wouldn't heat up at all everything else was working fine just the oven um, it didn't trip the main breaker I'm presuming something like a heating element fault uh, maybe a thermostat switch control unit fault there or even something simpler wiring at the back terminals but my uh, instincts tell me we're looking at a heating element which will uh, be taken out to test with the multimeter uh, I must stress before we do anything though the power's turned off on the switch to the cooker and also on a separate circuit at the consumer unit so there's no electricity there whatsoever. Um, first thing I'll do is pull the cooker out so we've got access to the back panel. We'll take that out and we'll take it from there. terminals to the element seem fine and what I'm going to do I'm going to disconnect these terminals so that we can remove the element from the oven yep so we'll take the element out and we'll test that with a multimeter and we'll pick up the video from there okay guys so we've got the element out i've inspected it there's no obvious signs of any external damage so we'll give it a continuity test with the multimeter now this multimeter has an audible setting for continuity so we'll just test that we'll test the reading make sure everything's fine yeah i couldn't ask for a better reading so we'll test the element, internal elements. Nothing. So again, absolutely nothing at all. So that is looking like my suspected part. So I shall get one of these ordered and then we'll take it from there. A new part has finally arrived. Check that against the existing part. That seems compatible. So we'll test that. See if we've got a resistance reading. Even new parts can be faulty. Multimeter up to around 200 ohms, do a resistance test. Oh, yeah, definitely getting a good reading there. Okay, what we'll do, we'll also do a continuity test in case the camera didn't pick that up. Let's There we go. So we'll get this fitted. Hopefully we'll have cured the problem.
that's had a good few minutes now and reached its maximum temperature so we're up and running just turn that down yep so very pleased with that guys um, my initial thoughts on the heating element proven correct there on this one save myself a little bit of money as well in the process um, so I do hope that it's been of use to you hope you found this video interesting uh, if you have please give it a thumbs up and also consider subscribing and as I always say thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next one